What's the story, amigos? This is Kino with some cool stories for today's story time. Here for AT Story Time, today I'll be reading out of Men in the Water of Life. This poem is from William Stratford, a story that could be true. If you were exchanged in the cradle and your real mother died without ever telling the story, then no one knows your name. And somewhere in the world, your father is lost and needs you, but you are far away. He can never find how true you are, how ready. When the great wind comes and the robberies of the rain, you stand in the corner shivering. The people who go by, you wonder at their calm. They miss the whisper that runs any day in your mind. Who are you really, wander? And the answer you have to give, no matter how dark and cold the world around you is, Maybe I'm a king. Again, that's by William Stratford. It's called A Story That Could Be True. Could all be true in the days, of course. Man, that story crazy. We just heard a story that could be true, William Stratford, out of, of course, Men in the Water of Life, mm -hmm. classic by Michael Mead. Yeah. How do you feel about it? Man, it's, uh, it's profound. And I feel like it's it makes you think, makes you wonder about, you know, how who you are, you know, and you know what your capabilities could be, what your potential could be, because at the end of the day, you know whatever you make it to be. Exactly. That's one point I get from this story. Today we are talking about paths in the days, so it's a very relevant story. Oh yeah. Because it's kind of like nobody knows the true path of this boy, not even his father. Right. And he's trying to figure it out, and then obviously at the end he says, well maybe I can be a king. There's obviously also, without telling the story, then no one knows your name. Mm -hmm. and that's back to your early point as well. Exactly. His name is whatever he makes it to be. Yeah. Who he is, what he does with his life, is whoever he makes it to be. Exactly. I feel like uh, it comes with if you don't if you don't explore your story, you won't ever know who you are. You won't be able to to know your name, quote unquote. You know what I mean? And I feel like uh, the way to go about like, trying to build your story, at least understand who you are and what you what you bring, is just being able to 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 explore your story and understand what the story is and try and build the story for yourself and your own truth and then explore that explore that that truth right there interpret that you know interpret that story that you've written and then tell the story to other people and let it be heard and let it become a truth you know what i mean live your story exactly yeah exactly i feel like with that you can actually get to the point where you know you know your name at that point because you built it and you 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 know, I mean, you created that. So even if you don't know who you are, I mean, that's how I feel like a lot of people when they're uh, when they're trying to explore, you know, even what, from the beginning, from an early exactly. age, no one really has a true destination, no purpose exactly. in life. You got to go out and find it. You got to see what you like, see what you don't like. And that's mm -hmm. back to the past. Maybe exactly. you got to go down that path to see what you don't like down that path. Exactly. So when you do find your right path, then you're like, oh, yeah, this is where I should be at. And that's the thing, because a lot of people, they come up and they look at other people for markers, like, man, I see what they're doing. That's really cool. Like, maybe that's a path for me. You know what I mean? But that's the thing. We all have similar stances in life, but we all have different positions because we all have a different background, a different perspective, because we all have our own days. And that's what we try to, you know, our own personal story to try and tell. So, um, and with that, you know, you have to be able to, to explore that and understand yourself Always. to move forward, you know? And, um, and I feel like even go down to the, to the quote, you know, how true you are and how ready you know, you can, how ready you are, you know what I mean? And uh, the ending quote of exactly. course as well, maybe I'm a king. And you know, me personally, I always speak about the high potential. That's my whole movement. And that's that seeing the potential within everybody. Mm -hmm. Everybody has the potential to be the greatest version of themselves or the whatever they want to be. So exactly. we have to just see it that we can all be kings, queens, whatever. And then see what you can do. You know what I mean? Just, I feel like if, until you explore, you don't know. You know, a lot of people, they have to, you have to be like, oh, I feel like I can do this. I feel like I can do that. I feel like I can be the best in this. Well, until you try, you know, you don't really know. No idea. So, Good point that's the thing, right there. But, that's story time for this week. William Stratford's Heat. A Story That Could Be True. Heat. 
So stay tuned, Monday Mix is out. That's right, topic video is out as well. And tomorrow, coming with y'all with the topic and the uh, twist. three twists coming with y'all with some heat, talking about some interesting characters, man. So keep it locked, stay tuned. Subscribe to the Q Network, of course. That's right. Conquer the days as well. Yeah. Yeah.